Following the recent debut of the Swift Concept at the Japan Mobility Show 2023, Suzuki presented the production spec version of its small hatchback ahead of its imminent market. Launch in the Japanese market, the new generation Swift benefits from a redesigned exterior, an overhauled interior, and upgraded underpinnings with a newly developed mild hybrid powertrain. Predictably, the new Swift looks just like the concept, even the alloy wheels, the exterior, and interior trim. And the colors are carried over from the prototypes exhibited in Tokyo just a few weeks ago. Besides the redesigned bodywork with the boxier LEDs, the fish like grill, and the sharp character line on the profile. A notable difference from its predecessor is the conventional door handles on the rear doors. The electrified versions can be identified by the thicker chrome finished garnish around the honeycomb grill and the hybrid emblems on the front fenders. The color palette includes nine color options. With four additional bitone options offering a black roof and pillars. The footprint of the 2020 for Suzuki Swift is nearly identical to the previous generation, meaning it most likely rides on an updated version of the existing Hartecht architecture. More specifically, the city car measures 3,860 millimeters 152 inches long, 1,695 millimeters 66.7 inches wide and 1,500 millimeters, 59.1 inches tall, with a wheelbase of 2,450 millimeters, 96.5 inches. Inside the centerpiece is the 9-inch infotainment touchscreen display. While the redesigned dashboard benefits from white textured inserts, there is no digital instrument cluster, but a small screen between the analog dials, just like in the previous generation. Other notable elements include the new climate controls, which are shared with other Suzuki models, and what appears to be a CD slot on the center console above the cufflders and multiple USB charging outlets. Last but not least, the handbrake is now electric with an auto hold function. In terms of safety, the new generation comes equipped with a millimeter wave radar, a monocular camera, and an ultrasonic sensor, resulting in improved performance from the Suzuki Safety Support Ada suite. The latter includes the dual sensor brake support too, which is better at detecting cars, bikes, motorcycles, and pedestrians. There is also an omnidirectional monitor camera, blind spot monitoring, and rear cross-traffic alert, petrol, and mild hybrid options. According to a dedicated page on Suzuki's Japanese website, the new Swift will be available in three trim levels, XG, Hybrid MX, and Hybrid MZ. The entry-level model comes fitted with a non-electrified petrol engine. While the mid-range and high-spec versions benefit from a mild hybrid setup, Suzuki didn't give us the detailed specifications, but said that the newly developed Z1 to E1.2 liter three-cylinder powertrain is highly efficient and offers sufficient torque from low speed. The addition of an ISG electric motor generator and a dedicated battery helps reduce fuel consumption as with the outgoing model. All versions of the JDM Spec 2020 for Suzuki Swift come standard with a new CVT automatic that is said to be lighter, more quiet, and more efficient compared to the previous unit. Power is transmitted to either the front or to all four wheels thanks to the optionally available full-time for WD system. The 2020 for Suzuki Swift will also be exported to other markets where it could get different powertrain options. It is not clear if the omission of the manual gearbox will affect the next-gen Swift Sport Hot hatch that is expected in 2025 as the existing model is carried over for 2024. Suzuki dealers in Japan are already accepting applications of interest for the new Swift. Pricing is set to be announced at a later date together with the detailed specifications of the model.